In this video, we'll look at how to install the Easy Portfolio DV Child theme. Go to Appearance then Themes in your dashboard and click on Add New. Upload theme and click on Choose File. Select the Easy Portfolio theme in your download location and click on Install Now. Wait for the theme to complete installation and then click on Activate to activate the installation. Your child theme will now appear in themes next to the DV theme. Hover over Pages and click on All Pages. Select all existing pages and delete them. Note that this should only be done if this is a fresh install of WordPress or you'll lose all of your pages. Open Trash after you deleted the pages and click on Empty Trash. Next hover over Posts and click on All Posts. Select all existing posts and delete them, again. This should only be done if this is a fresh install of WordPress or you'll lose all of your posts. Open Trash after you've deleted all posts and click on Empty Trash. Hover your mouse over Easy Portfolio DV Child Theme and click on Easy Demo Import. Scroll down and click on Import Demo Content and wait for Demo Content to finish importing. Hover over Settings and click on Permalinks. Sometimes WordPress permalink needs to be reset when you install a new child theme. Scroll down and click on Save Changes. Wait for the page to reload. And then click on Save Changes again. This will reset the permalinks back to normal. You'll notice that the portfolio slider is not showing on the front end of the theme after you upload the child. The reason for that is the short code for the child theme changing when you upload the theme. Let's fix that. Hover on DV and open the DV library. Move your mouse to the module shortcode section, highlight and copy the short code in the gallery carousel row. Open Theme Builder. Go to All Projects and click on Custom Body. Wait for All Project Template to open. Open Code Module Settings Delete the existing short code and paste the new short code in the code field. Save and exit. The portfolio slider is now visible on the front end. Hover over Plugins in the dashboard and click on Installed Plugins. Click on the Monarch Plugin Settings. Click on Social Sharing and then on Location. Choose Inline and Sidebar Location. And click on Networks to choose your social networks. Click on Social Networks and select the networks of your choice. Click on Apply and the on-save changes. 
Remember to add your credentials to the fields next to the social network. Next click on sidebar. Select the post type you want the social sidebar to appear on. Look through the extra customization you want to add to your social sidebar and click on save changes. Scroll up and click on social follow and then networks to add social networks. Select the networks you want to add and click on apply when you're done. Again, don't forget to add the credentials for the networks and click on save changes. Click on widgets. Uncheck display follower counts, display total followers, and display network names, and then save changes. The sidebar is now available on the side of the website for easy social sharing. Next hover over user and then click on profile. Click on choose file in the avatar to add your profile image, select your profile image and then click on open to select image. Scroll down till you get to biographical info and add your profile information to the biographical info field. Click on Update Profile to save the image and biographical info. The bio and profile image is now available on every blog post. That's it, you're done installing the Easy Portfolio DV Child theme. Get more amazing DV Child themes on gravityfox.co.